Hi, welcome to Hog Dungeons. Hog has got the lights turned down so that we can more easily see what Hog is trying to show. This is Hog Ed's barbell constructed for Hog Ed's use. Uh, and Hog Ed has a, an interest in the Hoggy Bird Angel, which is the sh Cherub Angel. And it's one of, of the creatures in heaven that the uh, Bible talks about. It talks about it having eyes everywhere. So Hog Ed made this weight plate and added eyes on it, or holes that simplify the understanding uh, of uh, just a, a simple eye. Um, this is very basic, very simple construction, yet it, it's, um, it represents something very complex. Uh, so Hog Ed simplified it. That way it would make more sense and we would be able to work with it So we have the the eye ring we'll call that the eye ring the Little names that aren't on the that aren't in scripture and then hog Ed Here recently made this what we call a face plate scripture says that uh, there were four faces on the angel in e Ezekiel and it calls them out uh, there was actually five called out in the Bible, depending on the scripture that you use. Um, Hoggett has uh, joined them, made five into four, and there's only four that is explained in the Bible in one scripture at a time. There's five altogether, only four are, are used in one explanation. The, we, we have the lion, then we have the eagle, and this one's man, it has a, a little, actually a full-size barbell at the top. It's man's uh, accomplishments and these little micro words that you, you can't really see. You have to get a magnifying glass and or just get up really, really close to it. Hog Ed photo re re reduced uh, these symbols down. And it says uh, Lambo Hog Ministries. And then the last one is the ox or the bull, whichever one. Um, a person feels more definite in using, more confident. Uh, I don't really think it, uh, the ox has got something to do with uh, man's work on earth. The bull's got something to do with uh, the strength of um, cattle and, and also symbolizes in another respect, uh, the power of the work that goes on through the animals that God has placed on the earth. And their um, uh, furious nature in the hunt. All of these, all these items are they are all, all hunters. They will all attack. They're all very, very mobile as well. There's a lot of powerful animals out there, even more powerful or just as powerful as these. These are the ones that were called out. So these are the ones that we use. And these little rings here, Hulk Ed uses them to add a little, little bit of uh, micro weight onto the bar. And it also adds to the 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 illustration of the angels um, Hoggett calls these the rings of fire and uh, scripture says that these angels um, had had wheels and they actually rode rode the wheels 
and they actually made noise even. So these are actually a, a representation of, of the wheels. So the only thing left is we got, uh, scripture talks about other things about them being double winged on each side and hands underneath the wings. I don't know. Hog has got the hands to, to do, the, do the, the exercising with. And my, the, the arms, I guess, of, of our bodies can sort of fill in that. And um, so that's probably the best uh, representation that we could probably do on this example. And it's, it's good to do because a lot of people have trouble remembering the way supernatural creatures are made. And if we can um, rebuild the, their assembly in a, a manner that is common to us, in a manner that we understand, then it, it will help our, our memory to come back and understand how that angel or how that creature was made and, and designed. So um, whether we use it or not, we always tr try to remember and we'll turn to somebody and we'll say, is that how that was? Or are, are we sure? Well, things like this, even though it's, uh, it's only a uh, representation, it helps. To, to remember the fine components, the elements that uh, re uh, represent the, the angel. Now all that's left is just to enjoy using it. And it's a constant reminder that God is with us. All right. Thank you from Hog Dungeons, and we'll we we'll, we will be together as as God enables us to. Thank you now from Hog Dungeons.